So now that your employer booth page has been updated and you're preparing for your virtual job fair event, there's a few things to keep in mind to make sure your event goes smoothly. So make sure that you have an agenda set, anything you'd like to review and discuss with attendees as mentioned and covered, and that you're ready for uh, the Q&A session in your event. But we, Illinois WorkNet has a couple articles that you can go to that provide some tips on how to best prepare for your event. So on the virtual job fair page under this section here, we do have uh, in this sentence here, uh, employers learn how to prepare for your VJF event and what to do while attending your event. And these will link to Illinois WorkNet articles with tips to best prepare, plan, attend, what to expect and so forth for your event. And clicking on those articles will take you to a page with more information. So in this preparing for virtual job fairs for employers, uh, there are some resources there such as a flyer and uh, a PowerPoint of the virtual job fair as well as a recording here. And so things to keep in mind are to plan your agenda, provide time for attendees, test any equipment, you know, make sure the lighting looks okay, the space that you're in that it's appropriate, and there's nothing you know distracting in the hanging on the walls or in the background and so forth. Uh, we also have a link to our uh, FAQ page if you um, for other considerations and questions you might have and additional resources to help you prepare for your virtual job fair event. So we have the virtual job fairs page, the event calendar that you can add your event to, a social media guide for employers, and additional articles, videos, and other resources uh, relating to um, hiring. And we also have some information about the Illinois WorkNet Service Finder, which is a directory of uh, locations throughout the state that can help you with hiring and, hiring and placement, labor market information, and employee training. And so this is the preparing for virtual job fairs uh, article and that other link will take you to attending virtual job fairs. And so this goes through, you know, kind of what to expect and next steps and what to do. And so, you know, be prepared to answer questions from attendees, you know, rather than saying, I don't know, um, you know, make sure that you have an answer for any specific questions that might come up. And you can also ask questions as well uh, of attendees. And with the events hosted with Illinois WorkNet, since they are 30 minutes, what you'll want to do is uh, to be concise in the information that you're providing attendees, be clear on what your company wants, what the different job openings are, uh, what type of employee you're looking for, skills, experience, and so forth. Provide contact and follow-up information. So if there's any questions that come to attendees' minds later, they can reach out to you and uh, be prepared to adapt to any potential te technology issues as they come up, because sometimes that will happen in webinar platforms. And so for next steps, uh, be responsive for any attendees who reach out to you if they um, seek more information about your company or the positions that are available, uh, be responsive uh, to them. And for any uh, candidates that look promising for the positions you have, uh, be sure to follow up with them as well. And again, we have more information about the Illinois WorkNet Service Finder and the different uh, services that uh, different locations throughout the state may provide to you.